as a resident, people ask me a lot, what kind of uh, TV show best represents medical doctors? There is Grey's Anatomy, there's House, there was ER, you know, and I'm going to go through each one and say what's good and what's bad and why I don't think those actually represent what doctors are really like. But there is a show that I think is the most accurate to all, compared to all medical shows, and I'll explain that as well. Number one, House. House MD. House MD is probably the farthest from reality. Number one, doctors never make house calls. In House MD, the doctors from there are always going to people's houses. That never happens. If you feel like somebody is really sick from some weird bug that was contracted from Thailand or something, we're not going to go to somebody's house and dig up their lawn and find that they planted roots from like another country. That just doesn't happen. Also, in House MD, they, he only takes care of one patient. He puts all his effort into one patient. A resident and then just a regular medical doctor will see up to 10 to 13 inpatients in a day. So that's totally unreasonable, putting in all of that effort, going to people's houses, digging up weird things. That just never happens. Number two, Grey's Anatomy. There are parts of Grey's Anatomy that are cool. Um, all the pressure that the kids are under, um, that, that has some accuracy. The fact that they all sleep with each other may be something that a lot of residents wish would happen, but it doesn't happen. Not as much as maybe people would like. Uh, in medical school, you might find that, find that really slutty uh, medical student, and that happens. There are those girls out there, uh, but in general, we don't sleep with each other even a third or like a quarter of as much as they think they do. So. ER. That's probably where most people get their idea of what medical doctors are like. ER, if you had all the stuff that happened to you and ER happened to you every single day, you just get burned out. A lot of the shows and a lot of the things in ER have uh, aspects of reality. Uh, crazy stuff happens. Crazy stuff always happens, but that's sort of... ER uh, puts about maybe a month's worth of crazy things into one day. So there's, n that's the one thing about ER, it's not that crazy. It's crazy, being a medical doctor is not an easy thing. Being a resident sucks, that's not it. The most accurate TV show by far, and I know that most medical doctors will agree with me, is this, Scrubs. You know, and what's the scariest thing about why it's so accurate is that it's funny. Uh, people think that, oh, there's no way that really happens. Every hospital, most residency programs have a Dr. Cox who's cocky, puts you down, makes you feel like crap, but cares about the patients. That's so common. Um, the way that they make residents feel like crap, feel uh, public humiliation, all of that stuff is real. And the funny thing is, is that most residents, when they watch Scrubs, it's actually sort of like therapy for them because they think about all the crap they go through. And it, to regular people, they look at that and they say, that's crazy. But unfortunately, that's our life. So if you are interested in medicine and you're interested in checking out a show that really represents how medical doctors are, Scrubs is probably the most accurate representation with all the crazy stuff that happens in scrubs, like surgeons or jocks and uh, internal medicine people or geeks. Unfortunately, a lot of that is true. Uh, if there was a television show that's not a medical TV show that would represent medical school really, really well, it would be, um, it would be the real world on MTV. Yep, I know. You don't people don't usually think of that as a medical show but when you get a whole bunch of really high strung people with type A personalities that want to show off and you put them in a confined space that's pretty much the real world and that's medical school so that's what I think uh, are the best representations on TV now of medical training and being a doctor I wanna know why the devils are not dry. I wanna know